I'm 13 News Now meteorologist Evan Stewart, and we are seeing temperatures warmer than yesterday, though still about 10 degrees below normal. We'll see temperatures rise a little bit tomorrow, and then a big push of Arctic air moves in just in time to bring in 2018. As we take a look at the satellite and radar, had a few clouds around this morning. Now we're looking at mostly sunny skies and a few showers off towards the south, but you'll notice there are some clouds out towards the west that'll move eastward. We could see in some of the far northern areas maybe an isolated flurry, but we're not expecting much around here for the rest of us. We are generally looking at cold temperatures tonight. Here's what Futurecast is showing. A few clouds moving in later tonight. We'll call it partly cloudy skies. Temperatures by 9 o'clock into 20s for most of us, and we'll see lows down into the 20s, a few upper teens and inland spots. As we go through the day on Saturday, clouds to start the day. We'll see a good deal of cloud cover through the morning and partly sunny skies by the afternoon. Notice temperatures by 3 o'clock up into the mid 40s. That's closer to normal. Normal high this time of year comes in around 49 degrees, so we are looking at temperatures back closer to normal, but this will be very short lived as a cold front is set to move in Saturday night, dropping those temperatures as we ring in 2018. For tonight, 23 degrees with increasing clouds. Another cold night, 23 for your low. Northerly winds at, uh, switching around towards the southeast at around 5 miles per hour. And tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures back closer to normal, 48 degrees. But then the bottom drops out of those temperatures once again on Sunday, 31. 26 on Monday for New Year's Day. Likely one of the coldest New Year's Days that we've seen since 1918, so in 100 years. 29 on Tuesday, 39 Wednesday, 33 Thursday, and 30 on Friday.